In this lecture, I am going to tell how the technology is changing the face of education. Nothing is important, all the change is constant. We know everything will be changed and has been changing with the time. The credit to the advancement of work goes to technology. Technology has been changing the face of the growth at rapid pace and its effect can be seen in education system as well. The system of education has been approved various ways and totally. It becomes tough to make a similarity with traditional aspect of education. The introduction of technology to the world of education has made it easier to student. Teacher can teach in many innovative ways and they can connect to student more easily and fast than before. The classroom has become more inclusive unlike before. With technology today, teaching has become an easy profession for teacher and it is the load of teacher as well. Global payment speed up the process of introducing technology in education. Today, taking place of technology is completion more than a child for school management, teacher and student. Also, in the last few years, many schools have made incorporate learning in their curriculum, but now each and every institution has to take aid of technology for running school and classes. Pandemic has made education refined for everyone. Virtual classroom and online classes have replaced is the traditional classroom method of teaching. So it would not be wrong to say that technology is a changing the face of education. Now, let us know how technology is changing the face of education and how it would look into the near future. First, multimedia education. Multimedia is a hub of opportunities and possibilities for teachers and students in the world of technology. We are very well aware of multimedia, but for the uninitiated, it covers ideas, videos, music, infographic, GIFs, and others. With help of audio, video, and other multimedia features, the teaching quality of teachers has been improved and now they are able to teach students in a better way. Teachers and students can use PowerPoint presentation, animation and what not to prepare their project in innovative way than before. Multimedia simplifies things and establish better communication, better teaching, teachers and students Multimedia is a born when education has come online. Next, augmented reality in education. Augmented reality is for teachers to provide quality education to their students. There are thousands of applications available specially made for education target various parts needed for students and teachers for students. 3D art definition apps are there for teaching visual art. It makes the teaching easy and more understandable with visual presentation. Augmented reality helps teachers to improve their learning outcome as it increases the engagement and interactivity between educator and learner. Today, augmented reality has become necessity, cost friendly accessible and effective for teaching. Next, e-study material. Earlier, the source to gain knowledge was teacher and student. The only option available to study extra was the library or just collecting the book from here and there. It wastes their time as well. However, availability of online study material 
is an advantage for students. Online study material helps students to get the study material just by sitting at one place. They need not search material for study in the library. They can access the knowledge anytime, anywhere. It has made it very simple and it offers so many alternatives to students to they can choose for their team. St studying online with peak learning student material made students for self-learning and it boosts their self-confidence. Efficient assessment. Assessment is the basic concept of teaching and it is important to assess what students have learned. Summative assessment and formative assessment are two types of assessment. The responsibility of teacher complete not only they teach their student but continue to assess their progress. The main objective of teaching is to ensure that the learners are learning and benefiting from it with the help of assessment. It is possible technology has made this, this part of education easy with the tracking process. With online teaching apps and classroom management apps, teachers can assess students perform in real time. Instant availability of information. With technology, learners are only a few clicks away from access the ocean of knowledge and information. They can search and find any kind of information on internet and can deliver from it. Next, artificial intelligence in education. Artificial intelligence has a much as helping hand to teacher. Grading system was made was time taking but no technology has introduced the automated grading system in a multi-choice question. Artificial intelligence also recommends improve on the V area of the student. Thus, there is no doubt that technology is changing the face of education. But there are some pros of pros and cons of a technology in education. Now, first I would like to share pros of technology. Students are now able to learn concepts in a better way. It is alternate form. Next, students are now able to learn concept in a better way. It is alternate to them. Students are now able to learn concept in a better way. It is alternate to them. Students are now able to learn concept in a better way. It is alternate to them. Cons of technology. Online media of education are making students not open to other well or development social phobia in them. Students are lacking in a follow discipline and it's changing their way of thinking towards school. So, these are the change of the technology. I hope that you have familiar with the use of the technology and way of the technology in classroom. If you like this video, please hit the bell icon and subscribe my channel for watching the upcoming videos.